in today's video we are going back to school supplies shopping this is probably my favorite video to film of the year and also your guys's favorite video of mine i'm super super excited for this year of school and i cannot wait to show you guys all the cute stationery that i'm going to get today but i'm going to show you what my must-haves are for back to school and what i get for this school year i like to get cute stationery but not go overboard so i'm going to show you everything that i get my pencil case all the folders that i get all the pens and everything and how i all organize it so i really hope you guys enjoy this video i hope you guys are excited for back to school and i hope this video can help you with what you need for school i'm going to give you a huge haul at the end so just stay tuned and let's go to the shops and get some school supplies So we're at the shop now, we're just going to the stationery aisle. Okay, there's kind of a lot of people. We're gonna start at this end and then work our way up. I'm with my cousin, by the way. What does jungle glue sticks mean? I think I'm gonna get this pack of two glue sticks. It's just like the normal ones from this brand. I don't really know. I don't know if I need sellotape. Maybe post-it notes. I might just get some post-it notes to make notes on. I don't know what ones are the best ones. That pack looks quite cool, but I know I don't need that many. I'm thinking like these ones should be good. I think I might already have highlighters, but these are quite good because they're the friction ones. I might just get one of these. These are like the ballpoint pens, but these are like the good ink ones. Maybe some friction ones. I love like the black friction pens. I've got an idea. I'll just get one of these black pens, but then get the ink because they've got the pack of like loads of ink. Okay, I think that's enough pens. I don't I'm also going to get some Tipex because I make a lot of mistakes in school. I've already got quite a lot of my stationery so I can just show you guys that as well. I might just get these scissors because they're like simple blue. I didn't even know there was a whole other aisle for stationery and all the pencil cases are actually really really good. They've got all the nice like pastel folders. This is so good for school. I don't know if I'm going to need one like this for notes or if I should just get the one that fits some paper in. I think we got all the school supplies that we need. Now we're just going to go and pick up the last things and then we'll head home. That was quite quick and easy and I feel like they had really good school supplies this year. Like they had a whole pastel section with like really nice stationery. Okay, all our stuff's on the till now. We also got some stuff to make sushi. <laughs> So I've just got home and I've laid out all of my supplies so I'm going to go through all of them with you guys. I went to the shop Le Clerc in France. It's not actually a stationery shop. It has a huge section for stationery and I was honestly so surprised. It was so 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 good. I literally found everything I need and they have everything for back to school. Notebooks, pencil cases, folders, binders, pens, all of it. It was amazing. So I really recommend that shop but I also did get some other things from other shops in Dubai that I bought before so I'm just going to show you everything. I'm going to start off with my pencil case and everything that's in it so far. So this is my pencil case this year. It zips up and it's got three compartments. To be honest, it's not my favorite pencil case I've ever had. It's quite simple, this one. I wanted one to match my bag because my bag's also navy, but it's not really the best quality. I'm not really sure. You can find loads of similar ones on Amazon. I do really like how spacious it is. It does fit all my stuff. It's just simple and good. So in the first compartment, I have got these pens from Paper Chase. They came in a huge pack. I'm really annoyed because I opened it and I literally found all these like colour stains on the pencil case. It's actually brand new so it's a bit annoying. I like to colour code my notes to make them a bit more fun so I will definitely be using these. And then there is four of these highlighter ones so they just look like this. They've got that like slanted tip. And then the last three are pens. I really like these pens. They're all just like black ballpoint pens. So first I had this math set so it has a ruler, a protractor and some of these ones and it comes with a Compass. Oh my god! Wow! I don't think I really need coloring pencils in school anymore, but it just came with some pastel coloring pencils. Okay, next in here I've got some scissors. It's a bit stupid because I literally just bought scissors, but I did not know I had these. I should have looked in this pencil case first. I think these are also from Paper Chase, but I can't really remember. Then I've got one of these pens. These are actually super, super good. It's one of the big pens this comes with black red blue and green remember when i was younger i used to try like push all of them down at the same time but it doesn't work so yeah <laughs> and then next i've got one of these papermate clear point pens if you get one thing from this video get this pencil it looks like a pen but it is a pencil it's just mechanical but yeah i absolutely love these pencils and they've got rubber on the end the last thing in here is just one of the mini glues okay in the last pocket which looks like this in the pencil case it's super cool. It's got like all these little compartments. I've got one of these rubbers and sharpeners in the first little compartment. And then in the next one, I've got a Tipex, which I think is almost run out. So I am glad that I brought some of these. Oh, 
And then this is a little pencil to put in the compass. Okay, that's everything in my pencil case so far. Now I'm going to show you the rest of my school supplies to add to my little collection. <laughs> First, we've got some of these mini post-it notes. These will be super good for marking books and things like that. And also my planner for what day I'm on. I love using these. And I've got another ruler. I don't really need this. I've already got like 50 in there. I've got another one of these rubbers, but I'm actually going to use this one rather than my other one because this is a nicer pink colour. These are the pens that always the teachers use and you know how they just write so well. I actually love these pens. Like there's just something about the way that they write is just so nice. So yeah, I've never actually had one of these. I always use friction pens, so I'm actually excited to <laughs> use this one. It's actually so weird that I'm excited to use a pen, but okay. And I've got this little notebook. I'm going to peel off the stickers. This is kind of like that maths paper, so I don't really know why I got this. I'm not going to lie. And then I'm 100% going to use this. I got this from Paper Chase whilst I was in Dubai. This is just ruled paper perfect for planning my homework like when assignments and stuff are due i feel like i'll use this all the time because i love writing to-do lists so this will be like my everyday to-do list for school and i've got so many glues there was actually like a huge pack of them but yeah they're just these ones i don't really know then i've got this which is the same color pink as that other notebook and this is like a little binder so i can put sheets in the middle also i'm not sure if i'm gonna need a binder but maybe for one of my lessons if i get loads of handouts then I can put them all in here. I don't really know what I'm going to need. That's why I kind of just got a bunch of stuff so I can see what I'm going to use, you know. Then this I also got from Maple Chase. I think this is a super good idea for school. So I got this five subject notebook. It's got these dividers to separate the subjects. They definitely give us notebooks in school. So I don't know how handy this is going to be. Then we've got another one of these pink folders. I guess it was a bit obsessed with the pastel pink section. This is another thing to like organize my subject handouts, but I think I'll actually use this. Usually I have all these papers that are just in random piles and they're just like so unorganized. It's all numbered and then when you open it up, you just slot your papers in and I just thought it's really, really good. Then next I've got some friction pens because you can never have too many. I didn't realize that I had that pen that has the blue, red and green on it. So I just got the friction pens that have all those colors. And I just got a plain black friction pen because these are the ones that I use the most. I thought this was really good. I've never seen a pack of the refills this big. So it comes with six refills of the ink. So when I run out of ink, I just put one of these in. Then I got some more of the tip axes or whiteout, whatever you call it. I do already have one of these, but I prefer the pink one. So I'm going to use that one. Look how cute they are though. <laughs> I better be writing like 24 seven with all these pencils and pens. So it's just the Bic mechanical pencils. These ones are really, really good. Then I got some more scissors, which I don't need. I'll probably be giving these to my brother. Although I kind of like these ones, they're a bit more soft. So I might give them the other ones. Yeah, they're just blue. This is like, there's not really much to say about them. And then lastly, I think this is the last thing. We've got some post-it notes. I think that's perfect for back to school. Maybe a bit overboard when I said I wouldn't be going overboard. But at least I'll be prepared. You can never have too many cute school supplies. I hope that helped you guys with what you need for back to school. I think this is literally everything. Obviously like a school bag and stuff. But this is mainly just my school supplies shopping video. And I will be making other videos of like everything in my school bag and things like that. But I hope you enjoyed my my back to school shopping video that I do every year. I absolutely love filming this video and I hope you guys liked it too. Back to school content has started. I'm super, super excited. Comment down below when you guys start school. Subscribe down below and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.